Brickhead Boy. This is Battles of the Churchill Tank. Brickmania versus Mechanized Brick. Now there will be 10 categories. So number one, presentation. The Brickmania Churchill has a nice small box, colored, very detailed picture of your product. Inside you have a nice instruction booklet. Shows you the illustrations and the pieces you need. Clear building instructions. On the end of the packet you have a nice illustration and side view of the tank. On the side of mechanized brick you have a big box with a almost black and white picture, a little bit of color. Inside the box you have your instructions in sheets of paper all folded up or just bent. So for presentation out of these two it goes to the Churchill Crocodile because it has a better instruction booklet and better packaging. On this side it looks like uh, you just printed it out from your uh, computer and you were done. So winner goes to Brick Mania. Number two, availability. The Brick Mania version is limited edition so you don't know how many is in stock. Um, sometimes they tell you, sometimes they don't. And if they're out, they might um, remake them. And sometimes they don't, so you're out of luck. Another thing too is Brickmania has promotions here and there, so you could get a sale sometimes. On this side, Mechanized Brick has been available for a while and their stock seems like it's unlimited, but you never know if they'll discontinue. As far as I know, this is pretty much the same tank, even Series 2. It's been out for a while. With availability, you never know when your product is going to run out. And Brickmania has the advantage here because their stuff just comes and goes and you never know when it's going to show up again or if it's discontinued. On the other side, Mechanized Brick. Their stuff's been around for a while and I don't see it going anywhere for quite some time. That's just my opinion. Um, that might change, but yes. Brickmania has the advantage. Brickmania. Number three, minifigure and accessories. Brickmania comes with a nice detailed minifigure, the custom hat, and prints are just awesome from the torso to the leggings, everything. On the other side, mechanized brick. Their minifigure is just a plain minifigure with a sticker on it. So, the winner here is Brickmania. Number four, durability. Brickmania side, the tank is really solid. You could pick it up pretty much anywhere. And yes, it feels solid and just strong. On mechanized brick side, it's kind of fragile. And you have to pick it up in certain areas, otherwise some pieces might just fall apart. So the advantage goes to Brick Mania. Category number five, play features and vehicle features. On this side, let's do the basics. You can rotate the turret. Elevate the cannon. You could open and close this. The threads roll on carpet, not on solid surfaces. There are a couple hatches here that open. And they get in the way of the turret, so you have to close them. There's a hatch here, and over here there's these to open. There's no hatch. But on the back right here, take out the turret, you can open these up, and you have your crocodile fuel tank back here. The stands come out so you can 
have this thing stay by itself and a little small feature open this up just to reveal your little fuel canisters on the side of the tank there's nothing there and on this side the basics again you can turn the turret 360 elevate this there's a few hatches that open these two these these two here as well as there goes your durability this the sides open up as well and most importantly this opens up so the Brickmania tank has a few play features has a nice um, container for the fuel so this is a flame tank a Churchill crocodile and for a mechanized brick there's just way more play features so the advantage goes to Churchill mechanized brick category number six building techniques the Churchill tanks main body and the Cassie is bricks not on top so the whole thing is built sideways and you have these little stud pieces as wheels there's a few other techniques as well but for the majority of it it's uh, just regular studs on top on this side mechanized brick has that very advanced building technique right in here in this area where studs are upside down and sideways and just everywhere so very complex other than that everything else is pretty basic and the side skirts are also studs not on top so lots of building techniques for this one both have pretty advanced techniques but the advantage goes to mechanized brick for the something I just couldn't figure out category number seven build to the actual model here are a couple of my 132 scale Churchills they appear to be a mar uh, uh, 7 so I'm not sure what it is but I'm pretty sure it's a 7 and based off that let's compare it to the Lego so brick mania let's take a look you have your little wheels how many you have nine and here nine as well and yeah quite a resemblance I mean you could tell it's the same type of tank let's take a look at mechanized brick so yes you have nine wheels nine wheels plus the two which is eleven and you have those little things maybe that suspension I don't know looks to me like mechanized brick looks a little bit more like a Churchill so brick mania looks more slick and more smooth um, on the other hand mechanized brick looks more rough and rugged and it looks more like the model because of these things so the advantage goes to mechanized brick category number eight size to minifig on brick mania side the tank is five studs wide in the center and nine studs plus the two so with the minifig standing the head is a little bit below the top on this side it's six studs wide in the center and the minifigure stands really low so to head the head has to be up here in other words I would say that's eight feet high that's a little too big yes the Churchill is bigger uh, I think has more detail the brick mania is smaller but it's I guess more minifig scale so the winner on this round is Brickmania. 
Category number nine, unique pieces. On Brickmania's side, a lot of common pieces can be found with the exception of the track, which is custom. You can buy that at brickmania.com and basically all their other things like printed stuff here, that's printed, um, minifigure, which I covered earlier, uh, that piece, those, so anything that has print on it, that's unique. But on the other hand, it is Lego, just I guess specialized Lego, modified. But then again, um, you could actually buy pieces like this from Chinese manufacturers and just use them. So what's the difference? Um, yes, they are Lego or they may not be Lego. Like the tracks, again, are not Lego made, but they're Lego quality. So what are unique pieces? On this side, mechanized brick, you have lots of these chain link track that are kind of hard to come by. You can go to brick link and get some. Um, on the other hand, you have these pieces here, which are also hard to come by. Um, there's a lot of regular pieces that can be found, but there's some that are hard to come by. Like I said, these and that. So, Mechanized Brick has some of their little bit unique pieces as well. They have these modified Lego pieces that are cut. So yeah, Brick Mania has specialized pieces, um, which you could only find because they're custom in their store or, um, you know, specialized shops that sell them. On the other hand, the Churchill, um, it's hard to order all these pieces and lots of them, especially those Lego tracks, like I said, are hard to come by. So... The winner on this round is the Churchill by Mechanized Brick. And now the final category, value. The piece to price comparison, let's check it out. On Brickmania's side, this tank has 765 pieces and retails for 315. Though, like I mentioned, you got these unique pieces, these custom prints, um, custom track, but majority of the pieces, like again, these wheels are just studs. On the other hand, Mechanized Brick has 973 pieces, just short of close to a thousand, and yes, you get. A lot of these chain link tracks, so probably 140 more track than here because for every one track, there's two of these. So the price of this is 250 with 973 pieces. And the winner goes to Mechanized Brick. So Mechanized Brick has five points. And Brickmania has five points, so I am sorry, but it's a tie. <laughs> all in all, I still would pick Mechanized Brick, but anyways, this Brickhead boy, thanks for watching.